up and welcome to the Juggalettes R Us. This is our show. The Juggalo Family Vloggers. Hello. We wanted to tell you guys what vinyl we're... We're Batgirl Jamie and Twisted J. I'm Batgirl Jamie and this is Twisted J here. And we want to tell you what vinyls we're looking forward to purchasing. Our next ones that we want to purchase. That are the ones that are highest on our list. Like, high, high on our list. And... One that's really high on my list is either one of the one of the band Panic at the Discos albums. Either um That's not really high on my list. Death of a Bachelor or um the one with uh I write Since Not Tragedies or the other one, um, Pretty Odd. Those are high on my list and um another one that's high on both of our list is um getting um Tunnel of Love. For my CD. Yeah, that's kind of up there for me. And I want to get Carnival of Carnage. And another one that's high on his list is some more metal. Yeah, definitely more metal. What metal bands are you looking um, forward to? God, um, I, I've been thinking about adding some Attila to my rep to it, um, but I, I really another can't think of anything. Another thing that's offerings. high on my list is uh. Some uh, more Misfits, the collection too, to be precise. I tried the Misfits once on karaoke. Mm. That made me like excited for the Misfits to buy another Misfits album. I'm like a big Misfits fan, so I I like that, and I want to get more ICP on vinyl. I'm definitely wanting to get more ICP on vinyl. Maybe even a little bit of Davy Suicide added to it. I can't. Oh, another one that's really high on my bucket list is the brand newest, the newest Davy Suicide album. Because I have his other two on CD, and I, so I really don't need those. And I've listened to them a ton on my, my phone, and the because I ripped them to my phone so I could listen to them outside of here, and they are just wonderful. So if they're if his new album is as good as those two, then I will just fall in love with it. So, and I already know I like the song Too Many Freaks because I have the single. And yeah, the Twisted album. Twisted. Yep. Another uh, album I really want is Freak Show from Twisted. Uh, I'm kind of wanting to go back to. And we kind of we kind of both want Beverly Kills also. Like I'm still wanting to go back to like the Twisted from Psychopathic Records stuff. I want it. Like Wicked and I want it, but I'm not. My thing about that whole buying the Twisted stuff is I want to make sure that it's stuff that they're going to still be getting money for. I'm not going to buy something that Psychopathic is getting all the money for it because if I'm buying something from an artist, I want to make sure they're, that I'm supporting them. That my money is yep, going yep. to them. So, that being said, I kind of want Green Book. I'm, if I buy any Twisted, it's going to be off it. I usually just, we usually buy a lot, a lot of our vinyl off of Amazon because it's easier to find exactly what we want. Another album I'm, that's on my bucket list is um, Abbey Road from the Beatles. What's something I'm... A lot of stuff on his, I think something on his bucket list is some Motorhead. Yeah, um. Motorhead and. I think it's the Ace of Spades album. Motorhead and, Motorhead and Iron Maiden. And possibly even Soundgarden's, um. Uh, Soundgarden's a good Super bucket Unknown, list. Super Unknown, I think, is what it is. Another album on my bucket list is Nirvana's Nevermind. Which, actually, that's reasonably priced on Amazon right that now. That might be one I get because I know that uh, that and the Unplugged album I would listen to like a lot because I have Nevermind and um, Unplugged on CD. I've listened to them so many times that they're such good albums. Dang, give it a break. If you're not big on buying vinyl, if you're not big on buying physical that I don't suggest getting a record player and investing the money that it would be to get a good record player because you're not going to use it. But it'll cost you about $100 if I not. say get the Audio Technica. If you've already got speakers to hook to it, that's good. If you don't have a component to hook to it, you're going to want to buy the one with the speakers. And yep, yep. I suggest getting like a $100 stereo where it plays CDs that will hook it to, like an LG or a Sony that's one of those little bookshelf speak stereos that have the big speakers that have some wattage, so it'll sound good. But, um... Like I said, that's what I'm going to do because my surround sound thing that I have my record player hooked up to and his is both going out, they're old, his is like six years old, mine's like uh, 15. 
Uh, his is at least six years old. Mine's it, no longer, actually his no longer, almost ten. His no longer plays CDs. But it still sounds good when it's um. His no longer plays CDs, and mine no longer will do the component parts in the back. It will only play CDs. I can't even listen to AM FM on it, so I really need a new one. He needs a new one, and we're really looking at hundred around one hundred and twenty to one hundred and fifty dollars um for one of those stereos like that. And the ones we found are LG brand that we think we want. He wants a little bit more wattage. I think it's unnecessary to get that high wattage. Sometimes when you the more wattage you get, the more um bass it has, and yep, sometimes yep. it drowns out the vocals and drowns out the beat. A little bit well I do have a little bit of control with that so so that being said that's the vinyl that we think we want I don't think there's anything else we really really wanted except for I wanted the run the only other bucket list album I have on my bucket list is a rap album mm. not from a juggalo group but from run DMC and it's the one with my Adidas it's tricky um, Walk This Way, it's that album, that one particular Run DMC album. It's their biggest one, and it's, I can't remember the exact name of it, but that's the one I want. Now I also think Bring Me the Horizons, um... Oh, he wants to get Sepaternal. Yeah, Sepaternal. Sepaternal, if you like Bring Me the Horizons, Sepaternal, and That's the Spirit, are excellent album. Yep. Sepaternal's a little bit better than the, than their newest one. Yeah, I don't know, I kind of... Like both of um, them the same. My my personal choices that that for him or suggestions for him or things that I own are um a day to remembers homesick and a day to remembers bad vibrations. They're ones I've listened to. Actually, bad vibrations is like one of my favorite rock albums to listen to that are newer rock. Yeah, I, I listen I like to that them. all the time. I like them too, but I'm just. I think I'm more of a fan of them than he yeah, is because I, think, I listen to them way more than he does. Like I have I, a, I even went as far as to pay like thirty some dollars for two vinyls. Yeah, exactly. Almost forty dollars for two vinyls, but they were great, worth it. Um, oh yeah. Every tax season, I buy a couple new vinyls, big vinyls, and throughout the year, I'll buy like one or two, and I don't buy a lot of brand new vinyls. Most of my vinyls are less than five, five bucks or less. And it's the same with him. That being said, I think that's all we've got for vinyls that we want. But if you got any suggestions of music we should listen to and possibly sounds really good on vinyl or you find a vinyl that you think we would like. Or if you have a band that has vinyl. Or if you're a band that just wants us to do reviews of your music, hit us up. We'll do it. But that being said, that's all we've got to talk about today. We will talk to you guys later. If you want to talk to us, you can talk to, if you really want to talk to us in particularly, we do live streams every Wednesday at 4 p.m. Eastern. You can talk to us then in the chat on our Which you can come thing. hang out. Oh, and if you want to be part of the hangout, you'll have to message us and we'll approve or disapprove of you being on there. We're, mm. we're really picky because of something <sighs> that happens that we cannot even discuss. discuss. We can't even tell you what happened. But other than that, we're going to let you guys go and we will see you in our next video. Peace out and much fun love to the Juggalo family. Diamonds Don't forget to out, comment, people. rate, and subscribe. Hit that subscribe button so you can see when we do new videos. Hit that bell so you don't miss any of our new videos. And check and make, if you had them hit before and you're, don't want, you want to make sure that they don't go away, check and make sure they're both hit if you've had them both hit or whichever one you had hit. And we will see you in our next video. Peace out, much fun love to the Juggalo family. Diamonds Thank you for out, watching people. and we'll see you later. Peace out and keep on rocking. Whoa, whoa.